Hi, I'm Steve with uh, Foiling Magazine, and I'm here with Adrian, the founder of Axis Foils. And Adrian, you've got an incredible array of new stuff for us to talk about. So um, let's just kick right into it. Tell us what's coming, uh, what's up next here in 2022 and the rest of 2023. Cheers. Steve, we've got a few new things in here I'd um, quickly like to cover. Maybe I'll start with, uh, this is a new uh, front wing we've got coming out. It's a ART699, it's a smaller brother to the 799 and it's something that a lot of the tow foilers have been using. It uh, works really well as a kite wing as well and actually the, the smaller wingers are using it quite a bit as well. Um, pairs really well uh, with our, our new advanced fuselage and the shorter fuselage and quite small rears. Uh, that makes a really nice tow setup and that's what um, Jeremy Wilmot's been using in Australia a lot. Um, this is the new high modulus carbon mast, comes in a, in a bunch of different sizes, 820, uh, 900 and even 1020. Um, this has really changed uh, foiling in my opinion because it's just such a rigid connection to your wing. Um, a lot of our biggest span wings, the, the connection is something I never imagined would be possible. And really, really nice uh, addition to any foil in our range. You've got that on this huge wing right here, this yeah, 1310. So. The 1310 is a new pump wing that we've come out with. And one of the things to actually designing that was coming out with the, with the, uh, the high modulus carbon wing to support that. It wouldn't have been possible on a normal mast. Um, as you go bigger and bigger, it becomes really important to have a, a super stiff connection. Um, we're also continuing our progressive rear wing lineup. Um, used to go down to 300, we're now adding a, a 275. And this little one here, this is a 250. So uh, yeah, everyone likes to seem to customize exactly what they want for their right. ride and um, works great for that. Um, the other thing I'd like to try and explain is the the advanced fuselage, it's been out for a little while now. This is two crazy short fuselage, and you can kind of see that the, the mast mount position is, is 40 mils further forward in the advance. Um, so when you set this up, you're riding the front wing, uh, and your back wing is your stabilizer. So really, you, to use the advanced fuselage, you have to move the mast 40 mils further forward in the board. What it does, the easiest way to explain it, is the position of that mast in the fuselage is very similar to uh, a fin in a, in a fin box. If you uh, move a fin forward on a surfboard, it loosens it up and makes it much uh, quicker turning, more surfy feeling. Further back gives you more drive and it makes it better upwind for winging. So uh, another customizable setup in our, in our range. Um, I guess we've got some of our uh, prone downwind boards there as well. Um, that's a, a 6.1 by 20, sorry, 6.3 by 21 and a half. Um, and this is a little one that we've got for the Tahitian kids. This one's 5.5 um, five by uh, 80, 19. Very, very small board, 68 litres, but they seem to be able to paddle that up in the, in the flat. Think so you think downwind winging is a, a downwind uh, foiling, downwind supping, downwind prone. This is a real thing. It's not just a thing for uh, Maui or the or Hood River. The conditions I've seen guys doing it in Australia, um, they're actually getting up in quite small bumps. I do not think it's something that's ever going to be easy. Uh, right. Anyone that I know that's doing it, they've all sort of said it's the hardest thing they've had to learn. Oh really? So yeah. Paddling up and getting going is the trick, uh, but. You know, we, we do have foils that are really working well for learning with that. We've had the 1300 PNG in our lineup for near on three years now, and it, it's a great wing, uh, it's worked really well. But with the new uh, high modulus power carbon mast, it's suddenly made it a lot uh, more usable because it's got the stability to control it. And that's probably the easiest wing for somebody to, to learn to downwind on. And so, um as much as you like building and designing this stuff, I know you're a frother on the water too. Yeah. So what do you like to ride yourself? If you're going out winging, it's blowing 15, just a nice day. Well, you know, what, what foil do you like? What mass do you like? What fuse do you like? That type of thing. I ride the 900 power carbon high modulus. Um, I ride the advanced uh, ultra short fuselage. I ride around a 350 rear. 
uh, and I ride the ART range. I like, I like glides, so I, I ride the 999 or the 1099. I like to go upwind, catch a bump and just ride back down without using the wing. And that, that glide is what, what gets me. Right, yeah. awesome, fantastic. Yeah. Uh, well, thank you. That was a very quick run through some extraordinary stuff. So thank you very much, Adrian. Good Cheers. to see you. Yep.